Hey guys, welcome back to Queen J's World. It is your girl Queen J back with another video. So today I wanted to try something new out. So I've been looking up like um, silk and like hammock glasses. And so today I'm going to be taking a silk class. I'm really excited. I might bring the camera in, but um, this is my first time doing it and I don't see anyone else in here. So it may be a solo dolo glass, but we will see. But um, yes, I will see you guys in the next clip. Done your gazelles. All right, you grabbed your back foot. So you're back in your invert position. What you all going to do is it's called a crochet. So your foot is going to go in the zone and around, and your foot's going to be plus. Okay, same with your left. So you're going to double crochet. Your body is going to be down, and then one leg at a time. You're going to drop, make sure your knee is hooked into the silk. Pull up and grab with your hand. Drop the other. Grab with your hand. You're going to climb up as high as you can go. Then focus on shooting your legs up, out, and down. And you'll be in it. I call it a diaper. You'll hear it called aviator or circus sit. There's a lot of names for it. Yeah, I like diaper. It's a really good look at diaper. To come down. You grab one side, whatever side you grab, so I'm grabbing my right, I'm just gonna roll my body towards the right, and I'm gonna let the silk go where it wants to go. So when I'm here, it's rolled off my butt, right behind my thigh. I know that I'm gonna need to hook this knee to stay safe, and it's around my back, so I can just roll down. My knee is hooked. It's a double gazelle or a double pole knee hook. I can lean back on board. <laughs> I can bring this foot around and then I'm right back in my invert. And look, just to see if you have any questions because that was a lot. I can move it over quickly. Uh, <laughs> yeah, don't put it in my back. So, first in the invert, and then I know those other things. In, out, and flex. Yeah, we'll walk you through it really good. You don't have to worry about the first part, we'll just do the crochet part. Just start with the crochet. Okay, so in. And shoot it up. Yes, perfect. Same with the other. Uh huh. Yes, beautiful. All right, the only thing I would do is try to turn this feet a little bit more and straighten those legs as hard as you can. Yes. All right, then pull down your right knee. So you can just drop your leg down, but you want your knee pit to really be in that fabric. So you want to push it back, yes. All right, take this one out and around. Then you're gonna reach up, use your abs to reach up and grip up here. Yes, now you can drop your left your left leg and reach up and grab with your left hand. Then climb up high with your arms. Shoot your legs up straight. See how you got them crossed? Yeah, keep them straight, out, and down while you're pulling up. Yes. All right, now you're in diaper. So you got the feel of it. Then grab one side. And roll towards me. Yes, perfect. This knee's gonna hook around both. All right, you're locked in, you can let go. Beautiful. All right, and then you can go ahead and bring your legs back to the zipper. Beautiful. Yes. Gorgeous. That was beautiful. So did you feel it when you were doing the yeah, so you have to climb up real high and then shoot your legs around and down because that'll give you the momentum to get up in that diaper real fast. Um, but what you did was great. So I think my, I think the uh, first part of your body through. Yes. Okay. Yes. Now bring your legs to the other side. Yes. Yeah. Um, you kind of want your leg to push from this side, but that, that was fine. From underneath. Uh, but that's okay, because I mean, you're ending up in the same spot. 
So you're still doing the pose. I thought I ran a Yeah, but it's okay. Alright guys, I picked up on it pretty easily. Um, so I'm super excited to start doing this like, on a regular. Um, but I'm going to show you guys how I learned the entire warm-up. Okay. Like the only other people I know that have really mechanics who are always like, Alright guys, so I just got out of my first um my first class. It was so super exciting. That was so much fun, y'all. And I'm definitely gonna keep coming here and keep doing it. It's something that I think I can do for myself and you know just have fun and meet new people. So I'm super excited to um, take you guys along on this journey with me. I hope you guys enjoyed um, this video and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Hey guys, welcome back to Queen J's World. This is actually probably going to be on the same video, but today I came back to twirl and I decided to do um, pole fitness. Oh my goodness, look at that lighting. I'm gonna stop right quick because I'm gonna go ahead and insert a clip in because I forgot to do my intro when I was coming in. So sorry for the train. I got stuck behind the train messing with my Instagram video, um, but this is from my um, quarantine, I think it's quarantine vibes, I think, set on my site. So guys, go to Clothes Over Bros and shop this look right now. 
But um, yes, I'm gonna go ahead and insert a clip. I don't remember that. Yeah. So yes, yeah, so I'm just getting out of a pole dancing. I was in the first level um, class. And so I'm so super excited to sign up for more classes. Um, this has really been fun. Um, I've kind of just been taking time to do some of the things that I love to do. Um, because life is too short not to enjoy it. You know what I'm saying? So um, um, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, you know going to class with me and yes if you guys want to see anything else on my channel please let me know down in the comment section below but right now don't forget to like comment and subscribe to this channel subscribe to this channel like and comment on this video and yeah um i hope to see you guys in my next video queen j over and out honey
Aquí a tu tu baila Había una vez, había una ni 